ABC's Nick Giovanni continues our team coverage this noon live in Lemonster with a closer look at the conditions there. Nick. Courtney, I can tell you it was a rainy, slushy mess for most of the morning here in Lemonster. We did see crews on the move, but they were essentially stuck playing the waiting game for this changeover to snow that Sarah was just talking about, which finally happened here around 10 15. It's slippery. It's, you gotta be careful. The storm on this January 23rd wasn't quite as easy as one, two, three for crews to keep up with Monday morning as it moved across Massachusetts. Slush, like everybody's least favorite thing to do, um, cleaning up a lake, and that's what it feels like. Mike McDuff and his team of plow drivers were out early in Lemonster, but could only do so much, waiting for the changeover to snow as the rain gradually began washing away the wintry scene from the weekend. It's disgusting. Um, I mean, this is typical, you know, winter is getting going. Um, Hard to deal with. Babysitting storms like trying to keep up with it, make sure everybody's safe, you know. Mm -hmm. Salt, salt some more and salt again. <laughs> While plows were out in full force, the trucks out treating the roads did the heavy lifting in the early hours Monday, tackling the area's first real taste of winter. You know, we saw this back in 2015 where it's all of a sudden you have nothing, nothing, nothing. You think we're gonna skate right through winter and go, all right, this was pretty easy, but then it's back to back blizzards. Back live with the snow now falling at least a little bit. Students did get an extra long weekend out of this. No school this past Friday and again today because of the weather. Not only here in Lemonster, but several of the surrounding districts as well, including Fitchburg, accounting for this snow. Live in Lemonster, Nick Giovanni, WBZ News.